We are gonna have some fun with this video, aren't we, Luna? It's another one of your embarrassing videos. You guys are gonna like this one. What's happening, guys? Welcome back to the Terrier Owner YouTube channel. Josh here with TerrierOwner.com. Luna's out here a little unwilling today because of the topic we'll be covering and she doesn't wanna get too embarrassed. But today, guys, we are gonna be covering 10 of the grossest things that a Jack Russell Terrier will do. That's right, sorry to do that to you. And be sure to stick around to the end of the video, guys, because I'm saving number 10 for very last just to make things interesting. Let's dive into them. All right, guys, like we said, welcome back to the channel. We're super happy to have you here. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, consider doing so now. This channel is made for all of you with Jack Russell Terriers to learn how to take care of this dog breed, to learn some tips and tricks, and to have some fun while doing it. Be sure to give us a thumbs up if you've been enjoying these videos, and to come back every Sunday at 11 a.m. when the newest video comes out. And don't forget about TerrierOwner.com, the blog site that goes hand in hand with this YouTube channel. Now, let's dive into those 10 things that are gross that a Jack Russell Terrier will do, starting with number one. Number one, guys, is probably something a ton of dogs do, but it is still disgusting. And it is when you catch this dog eating poop, their own poop or another dog's poop. I don't know if they do it intentionally, what causes them to do it, but it is something I have caught Luna doing. The only thing that made it a little less gross was the fact that it was only three degrees outside and that poop was a frozen ice cube from earlier that day. So instead of it being all, we won't even go into it, but it's definitely one of the gross things that Jack Russell Terriers do. Number two guys, and a lot of you who own Jack Russells probably don't think that it's super gross, but I'm kind of living in a city, medium population city where I'm not out on a farm, so it still grosses me out a little bit. But when they kill animals in your backyard and put them on your porch, I find that gross. If I know that she's had a dead mouse in her mouth that day, I'm not real quick to let her give me a kiss. I understand that it's what this dog is bred to do and that it happens with a lot of dogs, but it's still gross to me, so I had to include it in my list here. Number three, guys, and I'm sure you've seen this, is when they lick their butts, or if you have another dog in their house, when they lick the other dog's butt. Again, I don't have explanations for everything that's gonna be on this list. I'm just telling you what I've witnessed. As a Jack Russell Terrier owner, I apologize if all of you are feeling a little bit less willing to get some kisses from your dog tonight thinking about this, but butt licking is definitely number three on my list and one of the grossest things that Luna does. And while we're on the topic of licking, we might as well cover the ear licking that I talked about about three videos back, but ear licking is not one of my favorite things that Luna does. She does it to everybody in the house. I'm not exactly sure what causes that kind of licking either, but she licks inside of the ear, around the ear. She does it to Graham, the other dog, and she just goes after it when she does it. It's like there's a treat in the ear. It's pretty disgusting, but I'm sorry. I told you that I was going to tell them all this. Don't kiss me right now. Not during this video. Maybe another day. But ear licking is one of the grosser things that this dog does. Guys, number five is super hard for me to wrap my head around for a dog with this small of a body and probably a small little digestive system, but this dog's farts are the worst smelling thing on the planet. Shockingly enough, she farts less than our big dog, Graham. Graham has this thing where every time he jumps up onto like a piece of furniture onto the bed that he farts. I think it's something with the muscles in the butt, just letting that gas loose, but Luna's farts compared to Graham's are atrocious. They reek. It always smells just, it's terrible, but it is one of the gross things that I had to put on this list for you guys. Number six, guys, kind of plays into eating garbage, which a lot of dogs will eat garbage out of the trash can, especially when they have the ability to get to it easily. It's not a Jack Russell thing, it's an all dogs thing. Like if they smell an old plate of food, etc. But one time with Luna here, I wish I had it. Well, actually, I don't wish I had it on video, but Luna has gotten herself into one of the kids' diapers whenever he was younger, which happened to be a diaper from going number two. She shredded that diaper up, I understand it's disgusting, but we are trying to rank the 10 grossest things that Jack Russells do or that I've noticed with Luna. And when she ate a doo-doo diaper from my child, I definitely had to make sure that that ranked near the top of the list. The next one, guys, goes back into licking. No, that's not why she's licking my wrist right now. Something I find super gross about what Luna does or probably what a lot of dogs do is she licks sweat. So if you're coming back from the gym or you just mowed the yard, this dog with that salty sweat will immediately start licking your legs or trying to get the sweat off. 
kind of drives me insane. I think it's just something with salty sweat that attracts a dog to want to lick it. Gross for sure, and it's why it's on this list. My next one, guys, is something that Luna and Graham do. Um, pretty gross since they're supposed to be brothers and sisters, but um, the humping. I know all dogs do it, but I still don't like it. Usually I'll yell at them when it's taking place. Graham's fix. I do know that it's a boy and a girl dog. Opposite sex, I understand it. Luna humping Graham's face when he's laying down or vice versa. It's pretty gross. It's a little disturbing to watch, so we got to break it up when it happens. But if you have a male and a female dog in the house, I could be completely out of line saying that it's common that this happens. Maybe it should never happen. I'm not sure, but it's gross and it made the list. Number nine, guys, is finally a different um, trait. It's not licking and it's not eating something, but it's sniffing. And this dog is obsessed with it, its own poop. For some reason, when Luna goes poop outside in the morning or at night, or just whenever she needs to poop in general, her immediate reaction is to just give it a little sniff. She knows it just came out of her own butt, but it doesn't stop her from twirling around, doing a little dance, and then putting her nose right next to it. It's almost like she's checking if it is the record stinky poop that she has left for the week, the day, the month. She just has to get some satisfaction knowing that that's her poop. She left it there and wants to get a good whiff of it. Don't know why she does it, but I promise you she does and she does it often. And guys, number 10, like I said, if you stuck around this far in the video, we always appreciate it, but we wanted to save the best for last. The reason this one ended up making number 10 and the one I wanted to save is because it's the most recent development in the gross things that Luna does. And the reason it came about this year is because of the large amount of freeze that we had take place in the Midwest and snow. But for whatever reasons, guys, she, with all of the snow on the back porch, she forgot what is the grass and what is the porch. So what ended up happening as the snow compounded is we had a minefield of dog poop on the back porch, which when it started warming up in the last couple weeks, that poop heated up and we had to basically power wash the back porch soap it down and clean it up. It was gross because we obviously walk there, that's where I grill, and I was shocked to see that she got confused so easily by what is a wooden porch and what is the ground. It was annoying for sure. <laughs> I'm shocked I didn't realize it a little bit sooner, but if you get a lot of snow in your area and you have an area you don't want them to poop, be sure that you shovel it off quickly, apparently, because I was letting her out there and she was just pooping all over our porch. And of course, guys, this is a funny video, so we definitely wanna hear what your Jack Russell does that's gross what's the grossest thing that your dog has done be sure to leave those comments for us down below we'll see if we can top Luna's gross things or if anybody has any ones better than ours be sure if you haven't subscribed already that you consider doing so now we appreciate it greatly same thing with the thumbs up guys we appreciate that as well it helps us get seen by so many more on YouTube never forget to check out terrierowner.com it's a blog site with over 100 posts specifically for Jack Russell Terriers gonna answer a lot of your frequently asked questions and remember that we have new videos every Sunday at 11 a.m. So be sure to check those out, guys. We appreciate you guys. We look forward to hearing your gross stories about your Jack Russell Terrier, and we will see you in the next video. Take care.